What is the structure of a paragraph? Well, the basic structure of a paragraph is very similar for many different types of writing. You could use the same basic structure to write an opinion, descriptive, or an expository paragraph. It has an introduction or topic sentence, supporting details that connect to the topic sentence, and an example to support the details. What is a topic sentence? A topic sentence is the main idea of your paragraph. To have a good topic sentence, you have to have two things. One, the main idea, and two, the controlling idea. The main idea is the overall focus of your paragraph. For example, if you have the prompt, what is the best city in the world? You would say that the overall main idea is the best city in the world. The controlling idea is the direction or roadmap for your paragraph. This lets you or your reader know exactly what will be talked about in the paragraph. An example of a controlling idea could be for many reasons or for two reasons. So, when you put these two things together, you create one topic sentence with two parts. An example would be, the best city in the world is Barcelona for two reasons. Now it is your turn. Pause the video and try it out. What is the best city in the world? Write a topic sentence. What are supporting details? Supporting details are sentences that help further explain the topic sentence by connecting these sentences to the overall ideas. For example, one of the supporting details for the topic sentence above could be The first reason it is the best city is because it has amazing architecture. Now it is your turn. Pause the video and try it out. Write supporting details to support your topic sentence. What are examples? Examples are used to explain or give more information about the supporting details. For example, a sentence to support the detail above could be One of the most talked about churches in the world is La Sagrada Familia by Gaudí. He worked on this architectural wonder for many years and kept adding more details to his already complicated design. Now it is your turn. Pause the video and try it out. Write examples to further explain your ideas. Depending on how long your paragraph should be, you would need to add more supporting details and examples. Because two reasons were mentioned in the topic sentence, this means that one more supporting detail and example have to be added. Second supporting detail. The next reason Barcelona is the best city is because of the food. Second example. An example of some of the amazing food that Barcelona offers is their seafood paella. Because they are a coastal city, they have access to a variety of fresh seafood to use in their delicious food. This brings us to our concluding sentence. A concluding sentence is another way to restate the topic sentence and to give a summary of the ideas presented in your paragraph. Basically, this is the end to your paragraph and a way to remind everyone what you have written about above. To conclude, Barcelona is the best city in the world because of the amazing architecture that you can find there and its delicious food. Now it is your turn. Pause the video and try it out. Write a concluding sentence. So what does our paragraph look like? The best city in the world is Barcelona for two reasons. The first reason, it is the best city, is because it has a reason for the best city in the world because it has a reason for the best city in the world.
because of the amazing architecture and its delicious food. So, what did we learn today? Paragraphs have a topic sentence, supporting details, examples, and a concluding sentence. The topic sentence has two main parts. One, main idea, and two, the controlling idea. A concluding sentence restates the topic and summarizes the paragraph.